RPM is the number of rotations around a fixed axis in one minute. RPM can be measured with a number of tools, such as a stroboscope or a tachometer with reflective tape on the rotating element. For the purposes of this demo, we will use the built-in stroboscope on the OneProd Falcon Vibration Tool. The first thing that you want to do is locate the RPM on the motor's nameplate. If it is a VFD, then use the RPM on the shaft. Once you have identified the expected run speed, start above that value to ensure that you don't accidentally measure a multiple of the RPM. For example, on a motor with a run speed of 1765, 1800 might be a good starting point. Point the stroboscope at something you recognize, like a keyway or a bolt head. Keep moving the value down until the shaft begins moving very slowly. From here, fine-tune the stroboscope until the shaft appears to be completely frozen. Be careful to not touch the shaft, because it will appear as if it has been stopped. Completely freezing the rotating element with the stroboscope will ensure that you have identified the most accurate RPM possible. For more information, please visit us at vibraline.com.